I'm a transplant surgeon. I do liver and kidney transplants. My particular interest is pediatric liver transplantation. I am in charge of medical student education for the Department of Surgery. And then I have a, about half my time I spend doing research. So uh, my research is, uh, involves surgical quality improvement. I struggled as a young surgeon to, to kind of understand who to and not to operate on. I found telling people who kind of got too sick um, waiting for a liver transplant that they weren't candidates anymore. A very emotional or moving experience. It really motivated me to try to better understand surgical risk and who should get surgery, who shouldn't. So what I do now is essentially measure risk, kind of display it to patients and, and physicians to kind of improve clinical decision making. So who should you operate on and how aggressive should you be? And for people who are high risk, we train them and we've had a big impact. So that's where we're really going with it now. And we aspire to kind of um, to implement this across uh, outside of just our institution, but to do it across the state of Michigan. I think the impact of the work uh, that I'm doing can change the way we think about a big elective surgical care. And I think as you um, empower patients to really participate in their own care and make better decisions and really be um, in charge of it to a certain degree, um, they're going to do better. So I think um, it will enable hopefully surgeons and, and nurses to give better care. And then two is, I think for hospitals, one of the primary goals uh, is to try to get patients out of the hospital as quickly as possible. The hospital is not a good place to be when you're sick. And we've been able to reduce that a lot. Um, and that is good for patients and for families and for uh, uh, hospitals. I would describe IHPI as a, a toolkit for a researcher. There's people around here who can fill in your own gaps as a researcher and can give you um, all kinds of new ideas. So um, you know, I'm, I know what I'm good at. I'm a bedside clinical surgeon. I like to focus on surgery. I like to focus on high-risk surgical care. Um, and that's a pretty small kind of piece of the really complicated puzzle that is healthcare. So I think IHPI really um, pushes someone like me to think more broadly about what I'm working on um, and how it's applicable outside of just my little silo of, of, of uh, expertise. The primary work we're doing with IHPI is a program called MSHOP, Michigan Surgical Home and Optimization Program. And it is a program to implement across 40 Michigan hospitals um, a program of perioperative optimization. Within IHPI, there are several quality collaboratives uh, funded by Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Michigan. The one I've been involved in with, for many years is the Michigan Surgical Quality Collaborative, which is a, a collaboration of 72 hospitals in the state of Michigan to improve kind of general and vascular surgical care in the state. And uh, using these relationships within these institutions, uh, we hope to really transform um, the way uh, elective surgical care happens in Michigan. What does the future hold for healthcare and health policy? Um, we, patients, uh, hospitals, physicians, everyone are going to have to do more with less. It's pretty much that simple. And I think most good work happening now focuses on, on that. How can we give better care for and use less resources? Um, I think that's the, in the short term, or in the immediate term, that is uh, kind of the future of healthcare. Um, and I think that's a primary mission of, of, of IHPI is to um, kind of bring people together that, that are working on that mission. Mm -hmm.